every day. Like, what's our anchors today? Hello, Sycamore Junior High. Happy birthday. 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 Happy and we have another full episode of our daily video announcements. I'm Cece. Happy Wednesday. Only 12 more days of school. Hello, I'm Nick Lai. And now let's all please stand place to our right hand over our heart to say the Pledge of Allegiance together. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, and please be seated. More great news today. Remember, 8th graders, if you are interested in joining the high school dance team, there is a mandatory informational meeting Tuesday, May 24th at 7 p.m. Again, here's a little classroom code on the screen to join. T-N-Q-B-U-H-I. Also, 8th graders, another message from the high school. If you are a current 8th grader and interested in running for a Sycamore High School student counselor, student council this is the time to let them know you need to submit a 75 word maximum statement expressing why you should be erected to the sycamore high school student council as you see on the display here so submit to miss core shop core shop at sycamore schools and submissions are due no later than may 23rd at noon okay today's national day is national museum day Museums help to preserve the world's culture and history. The role of protecting objects and materials of cultural and historical importance helps us to better understand our heritage. Museums also help to provide an all-important link to the past. Despite their importance, some museums are on their way to becoming a thing of the past. This is due to the declining of number of museum vid visitors. This is especially true of the art and culture museums. In the United States, many museums have have suffered financially since the Great Recession in 2008. Due to financial problems, some museums had to close completely. To prevent this from happening, it's more important than ever to support them. Uh, not for the fact of the day. Did you know that the oldest official language was Sanskrit and was created about 5,000 BC? Today's daily survey. Yesterday's survey asked, would you rather sit with your friend on the bus or in class? There is over 130 responses, with a majority vote of 70% of you would rather sit with your friend in class instead of on the bus. Unfortunately, there will be no daily survey today. Next up, birthdays. Happy birthday to Hannah G, William H, Catherine K, and Maria K. We hope you have a wonderful day to celebrate. Now over to our wonderful and magnificent Mr. Harris. Good afternoon, Sycamore Junior High, and welcome to your video announcements. All right, just a couple brief announcements today. First of all, uh, why do you have a school email account if you don't check it? All right, you are missing important updates on things going on in school. Eighth graders going up to the high school next year, you could be losing important athletic information about start dates for uh, athletics and stuff over the summer. All right club information all kinds of things like that so guys every day make it a habit check your school email to make sure you're not missing anything and important making sure you're not missing a deadline making sure you know when your sports especially at the high school are going to start over this summer so check your school email every day Speaking of athletic announcements, during Flex Bell tomorrow, that's on Thursday, all right, there will be a meeting in the cafeteria for all 7th graders interested in running cross country here at the junior high next fall. So that will be tomorrow during Flex Bell. Mark that down so you don't forget it. Uh, cross country meeting in the cafeteria during Flex Bell. That's it for me. You guys have a great day, and I'll see you tomorrow. Over to Lily's Pet of the Week. Welcome to the Pet of the Week segment. Here are the favorite pets from, from the Pet of the Week. In fifth place is Benji with 13 votes. Luke is in fourth with 15 votes. Fifi Catito came in fourth with 16 votes. Second place was Oreo with 17 votes. And in first place, we have Thor with 18 votes. Thanks to everyone who filled out the survey. Now, here are two adoptable pets. The first is a senior corgi named Butters. Butters is about 10 years old and does great with other dogs and kids. 
If you want to foster or adopt butters, check out adoptapet.com or contact Louie's Legacy Animal Rescue. For the second pet, we have a senior domestic short hair named Biddy Kitty. Biddy Kitty is good with kids and good with other cats. If you'd like to foster or adopt this cat, check out adoptapet.com or contact Ohio Alley Cat Res Resource. Thanks for watching and have a great day. For lunch, we'll be having a walking taco bar. We will also serve hamburgers and cheeseburgers. To anyone who had a choir concert last night, congrats. Yes, congrats. I really loved all the costumes and how they matched the era of music everyone was singing. Now for the joke of the day. Thank you again to, Ms. to Brody from Miss Hurley's class. What did the positive charge say to the negative charge after their date? I don't know. What did it say? We have potential. <laughs> 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 Go, Go A's! A's.